everybody. Today we are far, far away from Capos. Well, about five hours away. Um, we are in La Fortuna, Arenal, and we're gonna be doing a walking tour and exploring the town. <laughs> we have people shouting at us already. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be walking around the town and because I don't know anything about this town, you're gonna explore it with us. And um, I don't have any information. So if you have any details or if I missed anything, leave a comment so that other people and I myself can learn with everyone. So I don't know if everything's open or closed. Our driver who dropped us like right at the beginning of the town basically told us we have about two kilometers to walk to like the actual downtown area. So we're just gonna start walking and see what we can find. Let's go. I think I saw this place online before. Pizza? Like the menu, yeah. Ba Vagabondo. You know what? I think it is going to stop raining. Okay. Huh? Huh? <laughs> very nice, very nice. <laughs> Oh, so here's the chocolate place, right? Oh, this is exactly already? what you didn't want to miss. Haha. Yeah. Well, that was good that we stopped here then. So this is like a chocolate teria. Chocolate, choc chocolate tree. Chocolateria. Chocolateria. <laughs> is it open yet? I don't, it looks like nothing's open. They have a big sign here of the COVID safety. Alcohol it up. So funny. <laughs> Every time I do this, I get it all over the camera. <laughs> Cleaning. Hmm. Hola, buenos días. Bien, ¿y usted? chocolate. This is with uh, passion fruit. Mmm. Mm. Mom, you should try that one. The passion fruit one? 70 bucks. It's so good. I was thinking about buying the bar of the passion fruit one. Mm -hmm. Very good. Look at this. 
I put a little bit of the jelly because sometimes oh, the bean is too small. It's not right in. Oh, or rice and rice. Oh, no, rice is. Should I eat the jelly too? Yeah, of course. It's the flavor. <laughs> it's good. The combination. Mm -hmm. Our chocolate with fruits, like passion fruit and mango and cranberries, we do like a jelly from those fruits. And we okay. Add the chocolate when we're tempering the chocolate. In case of flavors like orange or lemongrass, what we do is an essence and we add it to the chocolate before we temper the chocolate. So the whole chocolate has a flavor. Oh. All right, so we just bought a shit ton of chocolate. So this place makes their own chocolates. If you didn't hear what the lady was talking about, um, they do it all in there. They have like I don't know, 20 different flavors. And that's a variety of dark, white, um, milk, and a whole bunch of stuff inside. They give us samples of everything. So if you're ever here, just go in there and ask for samples. <laughs> and we got a map. So I don't know if I'll be able to open it while we're here. Maybe when we stop in a restaurant, we'll open it up and See how we're going. La Tipica. <laughs> so weird for once to actually feel like a tourist. <laughs> mm, empanadas. It's like a different hotel. Hotel Las Flores. Now here's a gallery. All sorts of wood product. There's a booby guitar. You see that? Right in there. Pizza a la legna. Well, I guess if I wanted pizza, I'm definitely not going to miss out on that. Yeah. It's a that cute place, actually. Fired. Yeah, and it looks like a cute place. It's another hotel here. I think basically we need to pass through all of these hotel area, like this little strip of hotels and like small stuff. And then we'll get into the downtown area. And it is getting humid all of a sudden. <laughs> Red Frog Coffee Roaster, iced coffee, mmm. Oh, they also have a hotel. Oh, it smells so good. Fresh roasted coffee. Ooh. Maybe on the way back we'll get a coffee. Or maybe on the way to the waterfall. <laughs> yeah. Restaurante El Colas Coloso a Coloso Arenal. Super Christian number four. <laughs> So like from the moment we got here, it was pouring rain yesterday. And this is like the longest period we've gone without rain so far. And I've been so cold. So, so, so cold. So I'm waiting for the moment to see if I'm gonna start sweating or what's gonna happen. <laughs> I don't imagine it though. But I feel like a dink. Like I feel like, you know how people dress when they come from San Jose to Capos? They come with like sneakers and long pants to the beach. 
I feel like one of those types of people right now in a different area. <laughs> Red frog. And it looks like we've got a little ways to walk. <laughs> what a cemetery in Costa Rica looks like. I think we are getting close. We just like walked all that way. Is that the volcano? I don't know. We don't know. We can't decide. We can't decide. But we are getting closer to life. It smells like beautiful smoked meat right here. It smells so good. Little baby cow. Baby cow, baby cow. There are so many hotels here. <laughs> Oh yeah, he told us that we were going to pass the sloth park and that's when the town starts pretty much. Good, good. It says coffee tour. And it has a phone number. <laughs> These are coffee trees, are they not? Or are they cacao? looks so similar. Coffee shop. It must be a tour of some sort. Mm, it is. It's a coffee like in here though. Yeah. Ah. The history of cacao. It's fun. And look, yeah, these are the coffee trees here. You can always tell by the ruffly leaves. flowers and little berries. I don't think it's coffee season yet. <laughs> oh, here's like a black bean, an old one. An old black bean. Huh. Back in there it looks like a pot where they maybe do, do like workshops or something. Cool. So like for me to come here is kind of like weird. Especially as like someone who lives here, but like also I look like a tourist, so it's kind of like um, the intensity of the tourist um, <laughs> um, It's a little bit um, Takes me aback takes me aback Yeah, so it's pretty commercialized here There's like literally water slide park there Oh, what's all this? Ruins. <laughs> Bulgarine Trail. I wonder what that would be. Sloth Trail Paradise. I didn't know this area was common to have sloths. <gasps> the sun! Where's this volcano? <laughs> it's gotta be that. Yeah, I think it is. Cause like, in all the photos it shows that at the end of the road. like some Italian restaurant. La Forchetta. Alright, let's continue. See, like over here, like there's a lot of mountains. Well, yeah, I don't know. We're on the hunt for the volcano, guys. <laughs> Liquor store, want to be here? La Street restaurant. Oh, I wonder if this is like some sort of club or something. Las Bracitas. 
Casino Bar Grill. Looks like it's closed down. Oh, here's the medical center if you need anything, like a pharmacy or something. Or help. <laughs> Spectacular Cantina. Mexican food. Oh, this is nice too. This is really cute. Nice logo. What is it called? There's no name. <laughs> I want to call it Fuego or something. Let's see. There's literally no name. Just look for that logo if you want to come here. It's way at the top. Maybe we'll see it on our way back. What it's called. Cannot read that for shit. Fortuin, ah, Fortunuin. Restaurante Fortune. Fortuneño? That is a difficult word to say. Latina pizza. There's a little art shop next to it. Bam Bamboo. On this other side, we just have a field here. Chained up field. That breeze is just something you don't find in Capo. <laughs> oh look, there's like a little tortilla and well, it's a soda. It's a soda. <laughs> oh, there's a spa right there. Ooh, Lava Lounge. I've heard of this place too. It's like a good bar to go to in the night, I think. There's nobody in there right now. Closed. There's a little ceviche shop right there. Ceviche la. <laughs> That's what it's called, ceviche la. Oh, well, this is so cute. It's like a little truck place. Oh, there's like a nice steak here. Steak, steak house, steak house. Oh, there's like a whole little area down here too. Pizza ranch. I feel like we could really be walking around in lots of different areas and not just the strip, but I think we'll just stick to this one for today. I don't know what this building is. Oh yes, this is, oh, this is the main church. The local church, guys. There's another hostel right here across the street. Oh, it has a cool entrance with some fake trees and a sloth hanging down. Lava Rocks Cafe. Seems like it might rain again. Oh look, this is the taxi place, isn't it? The Naturalist Tours. In a minute, we'll go walk up to the church and just see what it looks like. A little gelato shop. Ooh, there's Pops. Do you remember Pops from my Capos video? Fast food. Ooh, a butcher. Mm-hmm. They have cheese too. Oh, here's the main little park. Somebody said you can get nice cheeses up there. Even the cheese I had at breakfast was really good. It was different. So we have another souvenir shop here. 
Oh, it smells like fresh grass. Yeah. Wonderful. A cell phone repair shop. So this is the Central Park, which is right in front of the church, which is actually, that reminds me a lot of Parasol Are we going to go in now or? Uh, let's just go down to the end of the street and then. They also said taxis would be here, but I don't see a single one. Oh, I see some over there on that side. Sorry if the wind is affecting the sound, guys. Another pizza place. <laughs> Here's a monument. Emilia Alfaro Rojas. It's like a weird little area to just chill. Souvenirs, chocolate museum. Nice car. <laughs> Another super Christian. Another chocolate museum. Yeah. I wonder what's down there. I guess that leads to the neighborhoods, but they also have some cute shops along the way. And then here is where we can get our taxis like everyone told us. All right, let's go. <laughs> What is it? Wan Wan? Techno Cell electronic shop. Wow, this really feels more like a city. Wooden souvenirs. I feel like now we're really, yeah, we're really getting into like the souvenir area. Goyo! Everybody knows Goyo. It's a shoe store right there. Isa. This is like the more the commercial center right around the city. The locals come to do that. Shopping, I see. There's, yeah, there's a commercial center right there. There you'll probably find like a variety of things, electronic shops. I see a dentist, probably shoes, cheap clothes, stuff like that. Here's one of the places where you can buy lottery. gas station. Ooh, clothing. Promotion 2000. Go buy some cheap clothes. <laughs> That's a cute little place. Don Rufino restaurant. That's oh, really nice. Mm -hmm. And then here we have a live music and grill restaurant, Nanku. Nanku. Nanku ribs. I think I might start get, start be starting to be getting hungry. Here's another clothing store. <laughs> no, I'm saying. And here is the Cruz Roja. So if you have an emergency or whatever, go there. Ah, our beloved ice. <laughs> oh, and it's right next to it. it's Colby partner. Oh, this is a cute little street. Restaurant Nene. Nay nay. It's a court. Ooh, a bookstore. And games. They seem to have that lot of games and books like and books together. A bookstore and a game store. Mm-hmm. Cause they, well it's called a it's technically called a library. There's our Banco Popular. Looks like another church there too, actually. Oh, a little doggy waiting to cross the street. Oh, look, they have like a little taco corner here. 
This is cool. Urbano street food. Ah, he's coming. I wonder if he's lost. He doesn't look lost. Get off the road. <laughs> Oh, there's like nobody around here. Yeah, I think that's much this is the school. Yeah, we're almost at the end. There's a school and then there's the police station. Hola, papi! Oh, yeah, La Fortuna's backpackers. Where's the Selena? Did we totally just miss it? I know it was somewhere here. It must be one up down one of the side streets. <laughs> We've officially picked up a new friend, our protector for the day. Come on, bud. Come back to the hotel. The guys will take care of you. I'll send Hansel. <laughs> USA Outlet. I wonder if they have cheap stuff or more expensive stuff. Bless you. El Comodín. Fast food. Wow, they even have wood fire pizza. <laughs> oh, this is a nice schoolyard for the kids. The ones in Capos aren't quite so big. Oh, there's a construction and household store. And there we have the panaderia, which is like the bakery and coffee and American, woo, ropa americana. The hay market. <laughs> Tribute to Steve and Waz. Oh, vaporizing. Oh, well, there's another Libraria. Pretty much getting to the end here. So yeah, we're just gonna start cruising back that way. And uh, get back to the park. Obviously, the volcano is straight ahead of us, but wild cover. Is it actually in front of us? Sure. See if we can take some sort of beautiful photo of what's not there. <laughs> if you look here, there's the Selena there. Alright, so we're going into Jose Pablo. See what they can offer. That's a really cute outfit. Oh, I like that shirt too. Shopping! alcohol station. Got all kinds of nice clothes. Cute skirts. Alright, we are in a corner store because I'm dying of thirst. What is this? German beers. Wait. 500 colonas? Are you fucking kidding me? Whoa! Some of the beers are much cheaper here. Really? Uh-huh. Oh look, they have like natural guanabana in the bottle here. I try one of these beers. These beers are so cheap, they're less than a buck. Go for one now. What's the difference? Toasted beer or superior beer? Toasted beer, toasted beer.
right, guys, so we're just arriving to the park now. We're just gonna chill here for a little bit and then head over, well, go find a restaurant that we wanna hang out at. It does look like it's gonna rain at some point soon. We're gonna go and sit by that fountain over there. Go this way. So apparently there's a lot of these chocolate places around here. I don't think we'll go down that way, right? There's not much there. There's like a restaurant, a gym, liquidation outlet. All right, well, I guess this is pretty much, you wanted to go in? Or? Yeah, I want to go in that natural shop. All right, let's go into the natural shop. In the chocolate area? Uh, I don't think we need to go to another one, do you? I already saw the other one. <laughs> Stop raining, guys. So here's a good view of the church. It actually looks so, like this area looks so different from all the other previous videos I've seen compared to how it looks in reality. I wonder if my video will look the same. <laughs> Still noisy cars here. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go look for something to eat now. And then after that, probably just head back to the hotel. I feel like we've pretty much explored most of the stuff around here. If I, any if I missed anything, don't forget to leave that in the comments so other people can go. Or when I come back, I can check the places out. It's across the street. This town definitely seems a lot more city-like compared to Capos. Alright guys, I'm going to stop filming until we get into the restaurant. Okay guys, we just got to the restaurant and it is Pollo Fortunino. I cannot pronounce this word. It looks like a cute little kitty in the corner. <laughs> Whoa! Um, so yeah, let's see what we can get to eat. Organic fries, taco tico with um, shredded chicken, cabbage, and some fries. Let's eat. So um, apparently Uber is the way to go here. So we are down re-downloading the app because we haven't used it in so long. And apparently the difference is like, okay, so to get from here back to our hotel at Tabacon, which is about 20 minutes driving. Um, it's like nine to ten thousand colonas in a red taxi, but in an Uber it's gonna cost us like four thousand five hundred ish. That's what the that's what our server told us, so that's what we're gonna do. And uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna book the Uber now and then we'll be on our way. Okay, our Uber came. <laughs> I'm gonna stop filming while we're in there. Alright guys, so we just got back from our tour of La Fortuna downtown and I'm going to finish filming here because I'm tired and I want to start enjoying this hotel. So stay tuned for the rest of the videos that are going to be coming out this in the next, well I guess it's going to be like about three weeks of the La Fortuna series. So. Yeah, stay tuned for all those videos and I hope you enjoyed this one. Don't forget to leave a comment if you have any questions and subscribe to my channel to keep up with the rest of the series and all of the other great content that you guys love. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!